a lot of car for reasonable money. Under this motto, the second generation of the Nissan X-Trail crossover at one time flew with a bang. Surprisingly, despite a number of problems, the image of the car has not changed today. She is still loved and wanted. The start of production of the second Catrila, as the owners called the car in their circle, took place in 2007. The time for our economy is fertile, everything grew by leaps and bounds. The crossover fit right in. All-wheel drive, inexpensive, large, with a large trunk. Do not look that there is one platform with Qashqai. Initially, cars with gasoline engines of 2.0 liters, 141 horsepower, and 2.5 liters, 169 horsepower, were sold, which were paired with mechanics or a variator. Later, they were assisted by a 2-liter turbo diesel with 150 forces, a tempting option of which was a 6-speed Jatco automatic. Slow but reliable as hell, diesel cars with automatic transmissions cannot be found on the market today, worth their weight in gold due to the reliability of both units. It is not easy to buy even a gasoline version with a manual gearbox. Painfully, people are afraid of the variator, and rightly so, with which both gasoline engines were equipped. It is not that it is of increased brakeability, it simply requires frequent and costly maintenance. And the refusal to prevent the variator and the frequent replacement of expensive oil quickly leads to breakdowns. And then banknotes flew, just hold on, as for the operation of the motors, everything is more or less simple. Most cars on the market are 2-liter patrols. From them and most of the problems. In 2008, these engines came with a defect in the piston group and mercilessly ate oil. Whether there was a piston replacement under warranty is a subject to check before buying such a machine. But even without that, Already after 140 to 150,000 km, piston rings lie in some engines, increasing oil consumption. A set of rings plus caps, 80 US dollars, plus work for another 300 USD 400. Here also consider. But if the engine refused to start, we change the timing chain, 77 US dollars. After about 130,000 km of run, it tends to stretch. Often there are ailments due to oil leakage through the oil pan seal and antifreeze through all possible and impossible channels. It is curious that the 2.5 liter engine is structurally very similar to the 2.0, but he managed to earn a much more enviable reputation. We would gladly recommend the diesel version of the Nissan X-Trail with an automatic for purchase. It's a pity, but such cars in Ukraine are no more than 15% of the total. So your choice will most likely fall on the gasoline 2.5 liter version with a manual gearbox. As for diesel cars, they were expensive new, so they were not taken. Meanwhile, perhaps the only weak point of the M9R turbo diesel was the return channel of the fuel system, whose tubes and seals used to let diesel fuel through. Well, it is necessary to monitor the quality of fuel, of course. In general, there were a lot of complaints about the crossover. Restyling in 2010 partly smoothed the situation. The company reacted to problems, but many remained, every now and then a cheating fuel level sensor, Regardless of the engine, a capricious fuel pump that changes along with a fuel filter, about 260 US dollars for both. A very weak link is the heater motor, sometimes it is not enough for 3 to 4 years. And the brakes, steering rack, card and shaft joints and CV joints, as a rule, do not cause complaints. These nodes attract attention somewhere at the turn of 150,000 kilometers, which is quite normal. The paint work is gentle here. Chips and cloudy varnish are a common story. Especially gets from the pebbles to the edge of the non-galvanized roof, the back door can simply bloom too. Salon holds the blow of time is also not the best way. Crickets, abrasions that lose the shape of the seat can also be found on a car 3 to 4 years old. The stiffness of the Nissan X-Trail suspension has done a disservice to its reliability. Stabilizer struts and ball bearings live about 30 to 40,000 km. However, the repair is not too expensive. The cars of the early years of production are rather weak. They run 20 to 30,000 km, thrust bearings, $16 per unit. The struts and bushings of the anti-roll bars will last a little longer. In a word, there are a lot of problems with the car, but, surprisingly, this does not reduce the demand for it. Today, the price of a second Nissan X-Trail is practically frozen in time. The only thing you should be warned against is buying a car with an opaque service history. This is much more difficult to sell. But, in addition, serious and expensive problems with the engine or transmission may surface. To replace the bushings of the stabilizers, we remove the subframe, on which at the same time it is worth changing the silent blocks. Silent blocks and ball front lower arms run up to 100,000 km. Wheel bearings are also rented here, which are changed together with the hub, 106 US dollars. 
And here's another thing, ignore the sound of shock casings on the supports. Changing the expensive CVT fluid and S2 oil in the variator, every 60,000 kilometers, together with the filter will require about 300 US dollars. With work. A CVT pusher belt that needs to be replaced at 150,000 kilometers will cost the same amount. Otherwise, oil starvation will lead to a very expensive repair of the cones and the variator valve block. When buying a gasoline engine, you need to look at it not from above, but from below. Grease often oozes from under the oil pan. Antifreeze may be leaking. Causes, loss of tightness of the expansion tank, less often, leakage from under the thermostat gasket. If neither one nor the other, but the antifreeze still leaves, it's bad. This means that it enters the combustion chamber through the candle wells. It's hard to turn a blind eye to the fifth door corrosion problem under the license plate trim. The design miscalculation is that the plastic lining rubs over the paint and eats the coating down to the metal. Some sealing can prevent this, but dealers have tinted this area under warranty at one time. Many complain about the excessive sensitivity of standard parking sensors. But that's okay. A more unpleasant disease was thread-like cracks on the inside of the rear light windows. They grow over time. When buying, you should pay attention to this. Perhaps this will help to get a discount on the car.